Hi, this is Eric Peterson. I'm the broker and owner of Copa Real Estate in Austin, Texas. Today, I'm talking about how to protest your property taxes. First off, let's talk about what you can protest is the market value of the property and not how much in taxes you're paying. We talked in another video about how to protest your taxes online, so I won't cover that here, but that is the first step that you should take if you do have that option available to you. Now, if that's not an option or you didn't get a good result, then you will need to go for an informal hearing. Now, if you have the option of online, they'll send you back a date for that. If you don't have the option to protest online, you'll have to mail in your form and then they'll send you back a date for go for that informal hearing. When you send in your request, also send in a note and asking for them to send you the evidence packet or all the information that they're going to use in your hearing. That way you'll know what comps the appraisal district is using in your hearing and you won't get blindsided at the last minute where all of a sudden they're comparing your house to a home and you haven't thought about that. That other home could have a pool or something that would be substantially different and the only way you would know is if you had a chance to review that information before your hearing. Now, when you go for your hearing, you'll want to present your case to, on two sides. One is that the comps that they're using aren't good comps against your property. The second would be to provide them with additional comps that they're not considering that you feel would be better comps that might support a lower market value for your home. At that point, when you're meeting with the appraisal district, that person will have a little bit of leeway to make changes to your value and might give you a lower value right then on the spot. If they decide not to, then you have the option of going forward to the appraisal review board, a formal hearing, and that appraisal review board consists of three members of the community who will decide on your case. The appraisal review board is supposed to consider who has the preponderance of evidence, but don't be surprised if they take the viewpoint of the appraisal district instead of yours. After that, if you don't get the value that you feel is justified, you can still go to arbitration. That's a little bit outside of the scope of what I can cover in this video. If you need help coming up with comparable properties for your tax protest, or just have some questions about the tax protest system and how it works, please give me a call at 512-791-7473 or send me an email at eric at copa Thanks for watching and have a great day.